couple things. Um, one, first and foremost, I'm two hours away from my family, um, and family's everything to me. Um, so, you know, adding on to that, you know, Nova guys are an extension of my family, um, Jalen especially. And, but ultimately, it's, you know, I like to I like to win basketball games. And, and looking at, you know, the layout of where I was, you know, potentially going to land, um, I felt most comfortable coming here. Um, adding the family aspect and then adding just, you know, what they've done last year um, and how I can kind of plug in and, you know, benefit um, from everybody around me uh, and to help this team just go further. We have a hell of a team, first and foremost. Um, you know, we have a hell of a coach, and, you know, we're a deep team. I think there's going to be, you know, a lot of different lineups, a lot of different, you know, moving around. And, you know, that's that's not my decision to make. That's not my focus. My focus is to come in and help any way Tibbs asked me to. Um, you know, I have great chemistry with certain guys that obviously I'm familiar with. At the same time, um, you know, just playing with different lineups is going to help. Um, and ultimately the goal is to win games. It's not, you know, to get, you know, selfish, you know, accolades and stuff. So if we win games, everybody eats around us. No, it's actually funny. Um, you know, you see Josh, you know, on the social media stuff, making jokes and stuff. But um, Jalen and I never really talk about basketball, to be completely honest with you. He, you know, won – when we talk, when we are about basketball, it's you know that's the professional side, and we don't focus on that at all. That's not our friendship. That's not our relationship. Um, so he didn't know, um, and truly, I didn't know. Um, I didn't know how things were going to shake out. Um, you know, when everything's so hectic, um, and you know there's a pecking order in free agency. So sometimes you just got to wait things out and see where things land. So. Um, I will say they were really, really happy once I once I uh, the news came out. Um, so, yeah, Jalen, um, Facetime Jalen and Josh. Um, Jalen was dancing. Um, so, but that's you know that's Jalen fashion. Um, Josh making jokes. So, but it was good to see you know them kind of excited and relieved that I was you know joining them again. I mean, at the end of the day, like I said, that's not my focus. Um, my focus is to win games, whether. I'm starting, coming off the bench, playing 20, playing 40, doesn't matter. Um, you know, my focus is to win games. Um, you know, I signed a four-year deal here, so I plan to be here long term. And, you know, ultimately I plan to win a lot of games here with these guys, whether the lineup is starting lineup, closing lineup, whatever it is. Um, I trust in Tibbs' decision-making, and, you know, we go from there. Our focus is our, ourselves. Our focus isn't of what Milwaukee's doing and what's Boston doing. Because, um, you know, you see every year – in and out the team you know I was a part of a you know defending championship team last year I joined the the Warriors and you know we struggled last year throughout most of the season on the road um but everybody had us winning you know winning the Western Conference and doing this and doing that it's about you know what you're going to do in daily daily day in and day out and that's what our focus is here um I think that's why I enjoy it so much. Um, everybody's communication around the fact that we're not worried about, we're not focused on championship, we're not focused on Eastern Conference Finals, we're not focused on playoffs, we're focused on getting better and developing our habits because we know that you know all those things come with good habits. Um, and you'll see it at the end of the year is the best teams that have the best habits are the ones that are standing at the end. So I think the big thing for me is feeling of what are good shots and what are the shots that uh, I want to take and the team that wants me to take. Um, but in the game, you're never thinking about that. Um, I think that's where the fil film comes in. That's where the you know the coaching comes in, um, and ultimately, you know why I think I shot well last year is I wasn't worried about anything. I put my work in, and when you go out on the court, you just hoop um, and let things, you know, let things lay where they lay, and you know you go back the next day and you go back to work. You know, a big thing for us is like. You know, not just not getting carried away with the Nova stuff. Um, I think, you know, we had a lot of success in college. Um, and, you know, we've we've had some success in the NBA so far individually. Um, but ultimately, I know Jalen, I know Josh, they're developing relationships with everybody on the team, um, as, am, as am I. And ultimately, there's jokes always throughout the, year, and over, throughout the season, Nova Knicks and all that stuff. But, but ultimately, you know, we know what our goal is, and we know how to get there. And I think that's the stuff that, you know, we focus on in terms of the Nova stuff is what it takes to go 
to the national championship in college, what it takes to stay together through adversity. Um, but that's not the focus of this. Oh, it's going to be Jalen, Josh, and Dante to do stuff from Nova into the, the Knicks. Now it's how do we, you know, we can rely on that, but at the same time, how do we develop these relationships and how do we push together all as one? For people who are still getting to know you Knicks fans, what type of player or what type of qualities of a player do they expect to see when we take the course? Um, you know, the competitive nature um, from the moment I step on the court, the energy, uh, but no drama, no BS, just, you know, I just want to hoop, I just want to win games. So no matter what's asked of me, um, I'm always going to give 110%. Um, and I like to think that I try to make the best decision with the ball every time I get it.